Our initial work was to essentially validate the models and make sure that they're simulating the present climate fairly well. And then, as a second step, we are um, we uh, changed the amount of fossil fuel usage and the concentration of carbon dioxide, so that we, so that we could actually see um, what happens uh, in the past as well as in the future. One of my students asked, "How do you explain that 500 million years ago that there were palm trees and alligators at the North Pole?" And that seemed like an interesting scientific question. Now this was the time, at the time of, of, you know, dinosaurs and tropical forests everywhere. And it turns out that when you increase the carbon dioxide content by 10 times as much, it actually warms up the planet enough so that it's above freezing at the North and South Pole. And therefore, dinosaurs, crocodile, and palm trees could, could grow at the North Pole. This is, this was the, 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 on the fun part of science, we were able to understand how that happened.